350 men were primed and readied to teach the natives a lesson they'd never forget. It was a masterful plan. The veteran fighting chief Hapurona had fortified both Pa, Puketakawere and Onuku Kaitara, and he'd anticipated the troops would attack from the garrison over there in Waitara, and sure enough, they did. But what they didn't expect was this. The bulk of Hapurona's men weren't in the pa. They were hidden in rifle pits like this in between the two. The trap was set. After an artillery bombardment comes a full frontal British assault. Army and Navy vying to take the pa first. But little do they know what's in store. Hapurona's elaborate network of defences has been completely overlooked by the officers. Charging into the open, they're caught in a withering crossfire. They don't know what's hit them. The British were kind of lulled into a trap, really, and it's really disastrous for the British, and it is seen as a major defeat. The British suffer the heaviest defeat for war. Nearly one-fifth of their number um, end up as casualties, I think 30 killed and 34 wounded. So it's really quite a humiliating blow. The assault ends in disarray. Fleeing soldiers are hacked down. It's an unthinkable setback for imperial prestige. But for Māori, it's payback. Utu for Wairika.